Hello everybody, Jean back with more Mars Anomalies. Fellow Mars enthusiast from Canada, Christine Howard, submitted this anomaly to my executive producer, Brian Dobbs, and she asked us to kindly take a look at this up close. So let's have a look at the source and then I'll show you close-ups of this anomaly and some others that were found in this specific photograph. For those of you that have been following 3R Atlas, NASA has eventually decided to release their 3R Atlas data and images. They'll be doing so in a live stream later today. I'll include the link to this in the video description so you can watch it for yourselves. I think it's going to be at 3 p.m. Eastern, 10 o'clock in the evening here in South Africa. Tune in as NASA shares the latest images of interstellar comet 3R Atlas collected by several NASA missions. Hopefully we'll see high resolution photographs of this object taken by the high-rise camera on board the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter. Let's see what happens. So back to the topic at hand, we're going to be looking at a photograph taken by the Curiosity left navigation camera on Sol 2688. It was 2020 0.227 at the time. There's the original downloaded from the NASA site. I'll include the link to the source pages in the description as well. We'll be zooming in on the item that Christine highlighted for us over there to the top right. I went through this photograph and there's nothing else like this object at this site. It's got like a caved in shape to it and then these thin parts protruding off the one side and that brighter ridge on the top is at a slight angle so if you viewed this from the top, it looks as if that runs down the center line of that object. I don't know what to make of it, folks. It's really interesting. So I'm not sure what to make of this item, folks. To me, it looks highly artificial. Could it be some type of wreckage? Maybe part of a machine or some type of technology? There's also a strange activity on the sand slope around this item. It looks like water seepage running down the slopes. But this is the main item that we're focusing on, folks. Let's have a look at another anomaly at this site. This photograph was taken on the same sole, 2020 to 28 by the left navigation camera. There's the original photograph and we'll be zooming in on the strange item jutting up out of the surface over there to the left. Check that out folks. Long narrow item. Nothing else like it at this site either. These pieces also look irregular, lots of right angles, uniformity in the width of that piece. Let's have a look at some other rod-like anomalies photographed by the rover. Right, check this piece out. It's got like a bamboo type of appearance to it with segments. 
check that out and some irregular pieces of here to the bottom then this strange piece sticking up out of the sand uniform width to it as well and at the time of this photograph the sun was shining directly from above check it the shadow it costs and then this strange item I compared to a fossilized horseshoe crab some of you have mentioned that this looks like an oiling can it could be who knows folks so all credit goes to Christine Howard from Canada for submitting this anomaly to Brian and myself. Thank you very much, Christine. I hope this video did this item justice. So remember folks, in about three hours time, NASA will be sharing their images and data of 3i Atlas. I hope you enjoyed this brief presentation. Let's engage in the comments and have a chat about these anomalies. Let's see if this small community of ours can suss out what these items might be. I look forward to reading those. As always, thanks for watching.